Today, Kaimani's taxi rank was filled with another kind of hustle and bustle. Starting here, members of Sasko marched through the town. They continued on to the University of Stellenbosch's administration buildings. They are demanding a quicker turnaround time of transformation at the university. We're not saying that Afrikaans should be diminished. Afrikaans is one of our official languages within South Africa, we understand that. But we're saying that for each and every person who would like to actually have class in English, they should have that as an option. Secondly, we are fighting for the inclusion of this community within the institutions. This, the institutions should have a, have a bursary to actually make sure that these uh, individuals from these uh, communities are able to actually enroll there and they should be able to be taken care of from all angles. So financially, they shouldn't be embarrassed in any way. Secondly, we are saying that the university has a responsibility to do that because it's part of this uh, uh, sort of uh, community and it has to take a leading role when it comes to that. At the current council that we are having, there are certain people there that are untransformed. Untran uh, and thus, when we are having such individuals taking decisions on behalf of the university, that becomes problematic. I think it is really a cry from the hearts of our students, especially you know, black students marginalized on this campus, to be heard. It's a good thing that our students speak and that hopefully, you know, management and especially the council of university will listen to what our students are saying. The heart of the matter is that the more representatives you have from different groups, the more you represent the interests. And, and I think we way past the thing that, you know, certain people think that they can speak on behalf of other groups. And I think that is the heart of the matter. element that is against inclusivity in this university. Yeah. Today, my government, we are here to say that we are part and parcel of this university. Yeah. This university must open the doors of learning for us. Yeah. This university must open the culture of learning that is inclusive to all people of South Africa. Yeah. the university management to give a feedback on the um, demands of Open Salon Bosch and the university's SRC in reference to the language policy to ensure that the problems that exist currently are um, have a solution and then additionally we want to ensure that the transformation plan as mandated by the um, institutional internet and strategy documents are implemented and um, um, developed uh, within a, a, a very urgent uh, time period. Hundreds of demonstrators cheered loudly in front of the Admin B building when Sasco members handed over the memorandum to the Vice Chancellor Vim de Villiers. Look, I'm, I'm very pleased. This was a, a peaceful protest. It's, uh, this is the sort of thing that we that we want, and I, I welcome uh, student activism and, and protest. And and students need to talk out about about these issues. And and Sasco is a is a registered organisation here at this at the at the university and they followed the correct channels and, and that's to be commended. Um, so uh, with regard to, to their memorandum and their demands, we will now take time to, to have a look at that, but it also should be seen in concert with a number of other um, uh, proposals that we received from other student uh, uh, organizations with regard to the language uh, issue uh, particularly, and, and then we'll respond to that. Uh, we actually said that we'll do that early next week prior to going to, uh, to the council, to the scheduled council meeting on the, on the 28th of September. Sasco has given the university five days to deliver a response on the memorandum, or else they have said they will take further action.
I think the march is an important one. I think we definitely need to fast track transformation on campus. I think the emails that were sent out in various departments or by various individuals to incite um, some or fear monger among students is highly problematic. Um, we definitely need to stop the perpetuation of notions when black people gather. Um, it's highly problematic. This is part of the. This is part of the democratic process. Um, people have the right um, to march. Um, so I definitely look forward um, and I'm hopeful that the response from management will be a positive one. We definitely need to work towards ensuring that no one is excluded on this campus. I think this march was really successful and very powerful because the momentum of, Stellum, of transformation at Stellenbosch University is taking on a new dynamic and so um, the march definitely added to propelling the transformation agenda, um, which I'm really um, happy about um, to be part of as a student. Um, what made me very uncomfortable, um, like Wade shared um, earlier, was um, messages of, of fear and, and um, uh, by students and staff, um, and a heavy security presence at the march. Um, it, uh, it may be uncomfortable in the sense that when students of color gather or when um, movements gather around transformation, I'm not too sure the institution and students who don't understand know how to relate to it or how to react to it, and that's what made me uncomfortable. Um, I'm very glad that people from a neighboring community like Kaimandi um, came on to, to form part of the transformation agenda and transformation debate here at Stellenbosch University um, and I think something very positive was achieved. What I make of it is that people seem to be angry about the whole language situation and I agree that if they can't understand what they've been taught, they obviously need some sort of you know, change. They need a way to understand what they've been taught so they can help the country move forward towards a better future. I agree that a lot of what's been said is quite useful and quite helpful to the progression of our country. None of my classes have been cancelled. It seems to be well managed, so I'm okay with this. <laughs>